Hey, what is up guys? I'm back with another video. And in this video, I am going to be showing you guys how to improve your aim in Overwatch. This is for the people that have trouble um, with their aim with certain characters, mostly McCree. Um, because pretty much if you can aim as McCree, you'll be able to aim as most characters. And mostly it's just DPS, like things like tanks and, and other than a few support characters, I mean, you really don't have to have like insane aim. But I did want to show you guys uh, my method of improving my aim. And overwatch now step one i would say step one i would say is to get an aim trainer now right here i have this one uh saved in my presets it says aim trainer that's useful if you look that up in uh game browser and then you you know you search up uh for like creative matches um that's the one that i use now this is like an auto save that i made of it because it actually has some limitations like whenever i'm trying to train as like mccree it makes it where I can only, I can't like fan the hammer at all. Um, so I changed it to where I can do that. So that's why it, it's been uh, changed up a bit. But like with me, as you can see as McCree, I have um, a dot, which seems to be the best for me. Now you can go into your settings. Now here in your settings, you can change it to like whatever you like. Now, right now I'll see I have mine set as a dot and I have it kind of, you know, changed down to a dot size four thickness all the way down. You know, I have it dropped down like pretty low. Um, I used to do crosshairs, not this big, but my crosshairs used to be, uh, let's see if I can, I'd bring it down to about right here. And then the gap would be to about right here. And then the dot would be pretty small, something like that. Now, some people prefer, uh, a bigger crosshair and that's, you know, if you prefer a bigger crosshair, then go for that. Um, for me, I've always preferred something you know smaller like a dot it's just for me it's just easier for me to aim and shoot at people like uh having a smaller like aim see i mean i just shoot a lot better um i feel like this is a really good aim trainer as you can see there's a character over here it's usually genji doomfist or someone of that nature reaper um and then there's mercy farah sitting up here and then there's right here it's always going to be mccree uh baptiste um I think Symmetra, a few other, uh, Soldier, and then you have your tanks right here, which is like um, Reinhardt, Orisa. I'm trying to remember who else, Diva, um, Sigma, pretty much all your tanks are down there. Then up here would be like um, Ash, Ana, uh, who is it, Hanzo, Widowmaker, people like that. Now these people, I usually have a little bit of trouble shooting at but i mean of course you're not gonna hit every shot but um i have improved my aim greatly mostly my aim sits at about 50 percent whenever i'm shooting but i just come in here and i'll practice for a long time uh shooting at these people now the, the reason why i like having a fan the hammer is because you know i can practice on the tanks fanning the hammer and um i try not to use it too much because usually if you're gonna like stun someone you probably don't want to fan the hammer too much especially on like a normal player like if i'm going up against like diva also you can press um thanks you say thank you and you can be immortal so whenever they shoot you you can't actually be killed see i'm at one hp and i can't be killed so that's something to do and then also you can press f and you'll be powered up and then you can use your ult and you get your ultimate and it's kind of fun to play around and see you got five kills but i use this aim trainer a lot and um so i recommend getting it and then i also like change my crosshairs and stuff like that uh, things like that and then your sensitivity wise for me i don't know what your mouse dpi is but i have mine set at seven and my mouse dpi i honestly have no idea what it is i have a button on my mouse that i can click uh see i just turned it down and then this is me turning it back up i keep i typically play on a higher sensitivity just so i can turn like right now i'm doing like i'm just flicking my wrist sideways as far as i can and i'm already almost doing like a one doing like a 180 pretty much so i have my sensitivity pretty high whenever i play um but yeah, I would recommend just coming in here, tinkering with your uh, your sensitivity and your reticle and everything, and just practicing your aim and stuff. For me, I like to practice on these characters a lot because these are the type of people I shoot at a lot. And McCree seems to be like the hardest person for me to hit, and my aim's like never fully spot on. Um, but it's really a good place to, to practice. And if you're playing, you can get your aim good enough. Like for me, whenever I play, I have mine good enough to where whenever I'm playing with at least a decent team that... I can shoot pretty good, you know, and I can aim pretty well. I know right now it's not looking great, but if you're sitting around the 50 or 40% range, I think you're doing pretty good for yourself. Um, but yeah, um, 
I recommend just going in here, practicing. You know, it's also pretty fun to do. Hey guys, I realized that I forgot to do an outro for uh, my video. So this is the outro. I do hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys next time.